Hello, my name is Colin from UK Security Cameras. This video is about our IP camera range and our supplied software PSS. First, let's take a look at the two cameras we'll be using. Here's the XP1080D. As you can see, it's a, it's a low profile slimline dome. It's vandal proof and tamper proof, and it can be powered over Ethernet using uh, PoE or done via standard power supply. The output resolution can be set to 1080p, 720p or D1. Next is our XP3000V which is a 3 megapixel vandal proof dome camera with 20 meter infrared LEDs. This camera is available with a bracket for standoff which is shown here with a bracket or you can take it off and just have this part for standard ceiling mount or wall mount in the normal way. It also outputs 1080p, 720p and D1 but in 3 megapixel mode it outputs 2048 by 1536 pixel images. It is a micro SD card slot for independent recording purposes should you lose network connection. It has two alarm inputs and one alarm output as well as connection for microphone and speakers for one or two way audio. Both these cameras come supplied with free software called PSS and I'll give you a quick demonstration of that software now. So we'll go into the programs file and find PSS and then run PSS. It'll ask you for username and password, default is admin admin and then click login. Once you're logged in you'll see on the right hand side a device list and your screens here. So add a new device you right click on there and then hit device manager select add and then enter your information the camera here once you've done that you'll have a list of your cameras come up on the right hand side you can then drag and drop onto the screens like that you've got various buttons along the bottom here with uh, various views from 64 camera view 36 or you can have 16 or 4 or this is a multi views here or single view so let's bring that one up along the top right hand corner of each window as you'll see in each one has one you'll see some icons this one is uh, a zoom button so you can Drag an area and zoom in on, on yourself. You've got your display mode there. Local record will hit will start recording if you're not already recording to that PC. Snapshot will take a still. And the audio button there. Playback on this unit is uh, is here. Hit playback. Choose the device because each of these units has got an SD card built in you see so you can interrogate the SD card over the network hit search button and you will then get a list of recorded files here so select one and hit play and there's the camera from earlier you can also export to AVI for a media player playback or you can just download to this PC for saving later As a side note, we did try the cameras using Apple Macs and we found that they work fine using normal web browser, but on occasion you would get one or two seconds of grey as the graphics refreshed. Other than that, absolutely fine.